Can you just welcome back? Salam alaikum. We're gonna do some uh, gaming review here. Another one with the uh, Asus ROG3 Fortnite, and let's show you here the settings for the Fortnite. Unfortunately, sad, uh, sad news. There is no 60 FPS for the ROG3, but there is epic quality present. So that's good. That's good. Anyway, we're gonna go back and run this game immediately. We're gonna just use squads as uh, squad. Team Rumble. Team Rumble. And use the Team Rumble. Stay tuned. You will have the buying links in the description. Here we are in, we are in Ninjas. Here we have the FPS meter on the line on the right, and we're gonna have here on the left. By the way, I'm using the X mode. Yes, high for 144 hertz. But again, this game is capped at 30 FPS, so there's no point of playing it at 144 hertz. Just lower it at 60 hertz or put it just on auto. I will do it. Why well, I didn't do it immediately? Here we go. So you don't have this flickering. Uh, I mean, you don't see it in real life, you just see it on the camera. But it's running really good, bro. Hey, what was that? What is this, man? And just honestly, I don't know what was that. Why did exit the game? Was that some bug or something like that to the latest version of Fortnite? I don't know. We'll be testing also the temperatures of Fortnite on Asus ROG3. It's not gonna probably it's not gonna uh, heat up. By my prediction, the temperature should be under 40. Should be under under 40. The physical temperature, which we uh, basically feel on the display. The CPU, I don't know. The speakers are amazing, ninjas. I love these speakers so much. I just love the bass. I love the stereo uh, effect. I love this direct chip, bro. The sound chip inside of this beast uh, is really complete, complete, ninjas. You're gonna be completely complete there, completely complete. <laughs> You're gonna be completed there regarding the gaming. You probably have a gamepad. And, oh my God, why I didn't connect it? The, the Fortnite supports the gamepad. I don't know why I didn't do that. I just don't get it. Follow us now, it's too late, I think so. Whoa! Oh my god! Look at this, bro! What? What the heck? They improved the graphics so much, bro! Look at this, bro! That is impressive! This is very impressive! I didn't know that such... Wow, that is very impressive, bro! That is very, very impressive here with this new update! Can we do this with the house? We can! Oh my god, look at this. This was this didn't exist in the first update of Fortnite, the season one. This is awesome, bro. You have to admit that this is graphically really awesome. Wow. I wish we can do something like this on PUBG, uh, to on PUBG to you know to burn the house, at least the wooden ones. The small house. That would be amazing, bro. <laughs> oh no! Me playing around while the storm is coming. So I think now is the best way, uh, the best time to enable the gamepad. You see, it exit the game completely. Now I have to wait it again. Yarb. Anyway, stay tuned. Okay, so let's show you here the Ipega PG9999. It just works fine here. You know, check here the temperatures. So Fortnite is already running maybe 8-10 minutes. 
temperatures. Like I told you, I knew it is going to be under 40. So it's running 38. Because it's running 30 FPS. If we had 60 FPS mode, this temperature would be higher, bro. X mode enabled. Sweet. Very, very smooth, bro. On Epic Graphics, it's running uh, 30 FPS. 